what's going on? It's Amy again with Bargain Mama, and it is scorching hot outside. I think it's like 115 or something in Arizona. It is so flipping hot. It's crazy, and then humid because it's monsoon season. <sighs> Insane. But you guys, I found amazing stuff at Dollar Tree. I was super excited. Most of the stores I've been to, they've all had Thanksgiving out and no Halloween, which I thought was weird. But then the last one I went to today did have Halloween out. Um, but I'm just waiting for Christmas. I just keep wanting to go back and wait for Christmas because I just feel like it is 115 degrees outside. And if I see Christmas on there, maybe I won't feel so hot. I don't even know. It is just scorching hot. But I found some, I don't need to keep playing with my hair. I did get yelled at in one of my videos. Um, I'm gonna just try to put it up because it is super hot and sweaty. But I don't know if I can get it up, hold on. Um, so I tried to tie it, we'll see. Anyways, I found, this is just a mess of everything. It's um, cleaning stuff, it is crafting stuff, it is Halloween, no it's not, it's Thanksgiving stuff. It's all kinds of stuff. So anyways, guys, let's get started. The first thing I want to show you is you've seen this a million times, but I want to show you what happens to modeling clay if you leave it outside in Arizona sun in your car, like it's all melted on the back. So this is just the modeling clay, um, 12 pieces, but yep, that's what happens. Like all of these have melted into each other. And if you look at my community tab, they also had Crayola air dry clay there, which I thought was kind of cool. So I did get this because I want to try it. It's the Crayola Model Magic. I have been watching this thing, and this is red, it's just one ounce. I've been watching this thing on Facebook. It's a group, and their stuff is amazing that they've been making out of like modeling clay and stuff. So I just wanted to see, oh, this is light. Oh, I don't know what that smell is. It's very light though. So I just got it because I just wanted to see what it was. So. It's, I think it's like glitz and glitter or something on Facebook and they make the most amazing things out of like modeling clay. So anyways, um, I'm just going to be all over the place. I found this and it's just like kind of canvasy. Um, it's a tote bag, 14.17 by 15.75 inches. Um, it's like mesh or canvas something. So I got two of these just so I can make them for Christmas. Um, I actually have been crafting, so I can't wait to show you guys my videos. So I just, they're the larger ones, so I just got those for Christmas, um, to make into Christmas things. Um, I was trying to see, try to stay kind of on the same thing since I'm in that one, but I don't know. I got these, and in my walkthrough I showed a different, um, like, one of these, I guess. Like, it just said to-do list on the side instead of, um this week and so it is an acrylic note board and I got two one for me and one for my son and um I also took pictures they had what dry erase cray crayons I did not know because I mean honestly if you write on like a dry erase board with a crayon it's gonna come off if you just kind of scrape it a little but they were dry erase crayons I didn't get any because I didn't need them but I thought they were cool so anyways, this is just, yeah, I got this for, you know, just to put by our, um, like by his computer in his room and by my desk so that, I mean, and you can put it on whatever side you want, but I just, like I said, I got it so that my phone can be sitting up. I like to watch YouTube when I'm doing things and usually have to prop it up against something and hope the bottom doesn't slide out. So now I have this. So I got two, one for me and one for my son. Um, I did pick up this mushroom. Again, I think it was on that same channel, the Glitz channel. They turned this into a gnome, and I thought it was so cute. So I want to, I looked how to um, paint glossy ceramic, and so I'm gonna sand this down, and I want to paint his hat red, and then put some white fur around here, and I wanna actually turn this, they had it just a regular gnome, but I wanna turn him into a Santa Claus gnome. So I'm super excited about trying that. They just put like the, twine or something like down right here put a nose guys I thought it was super cool so I'm gonna try that it is so hot okay so let's see I showed these in my walkthrough also I did just pick up one they are the notebooks 3.5 inches by 5.7 inches but I picked it up because I like that it's leather and because I want to put fabric on it so it already has its own little pen holder so I want to put fabric on it and turn it into a 
Oh, it already has this, which is super cute. I can put some charms on it. And I just want to, oh, does that come out? So it's just a notebook holder. I wish I would have seen that because I would have gotten so many more of these. I want to turn it into like a Christmas planner. So I'll be doing that soon also. I love that it has just this little super cute for $1.25 and has the pen holder. It's done. Okay. Anyways, let's keep going. I did pick this up today. This is for my new grandbaby. I had never seen this. It's the Fisher Price Brush Buddies Toddler Dental Kit. And it says perfect for teething toddlers and it's zero plus months and it's two packages of the toothbrush. But I like this one has a bigger handle and this one has like a longer handle. Um, and so I don't know, I just think it's super cute. So, so this is a toddler toothbrush with a teething ring. And this is a little one's toothbrush. So yeah, this will be the one he gets. It's like got the gummy stuff on the side. I just think that was super good for $1.25. So I picked that up. Oh, I picked these up. The baby shower favors, the little blue shoes. Because I remember they used these as the shoes on the bottom of the gnome. So I'm going to make those into Santa's boots. So that's why I got those. I'm going to do that. And then I did pick these up, and these are just the five-piece badge holders. But I know, you guys like, Amy, you're opening every single thing that I want you to see. So I saw a thing, I've been watching too much YouTube or something, um, where they put, like, just, like, confetti or whatever in here and then sealed right here. And then it's just, like, a, um, it's a shaker. So it's already done for you. The edges are already sealed. They didn't use this part. I mean, you could. But so this right here is already sealed everywhere for you except for the top. So they just put stuff in here, like different little things, and then sealed the top right here. And it was the cutest little shaker. So I picked those up. So there's five of them. Okay. Let's see what else. Um, I think we're kind of in the crafting. So I just got scotch double-sided tape. Um, yeah, no mess. You guys know what scotch tape is. It's just the double-sided. Um, I picked this up, and I've already used it. So I had this also in my walkthrough. The B.I. Beauty Intuition Donuts Jumbo Lip Balm. It is cruelty-free. But, you guys, oh my gosh, this smells and tastes the most amazing ever. Oh my gosh. It smells amazing. I am in love with this. So, oh, it's so good. So I picked that up. I'm trying to see what else. Oh, I guess I thought I needed two things of double-sided tape. Um, let me see, let me do these real quick. Yeah, I'm trying to go fast. So I did pick up two of these, and these are just the round serving trays. And I picked them up because I feel like they look like pretty kind of high-end-ish. So, yeah. I picked up two so I can put them up probably in my kitchen or something. I don't know. But I had wanted these for a while, even though I'm downsizing and trying not to get stuff. I had really wanted these for like a year, so I found them and I got them. Okay, so that is that part. So now let's move on to just a couple cleaning things. And this is the washing machine cleaner I have wanted for a while also. And I'm sure you guys know how it works. Everyone has got it. Not for use with clothes. I guess it, yeah. Okay, it just goes in the washer. I was like, uh, that's what I bought it for. Um, pour one pouch of washing machine. So it's only one in here. Oh, there's three. So there's three pouches in here. So that's awesome. That's definitely not the way you open it. But, so I picked those up to wash out my washer. And then, let me see here. I picked these up. So first, let me show you. I picked these Pretty Woman nails up, and there's 24 nails, and they have the glue. I picked these up to wear to my son's baby shower because they're blue. They're a blue mats. I love them. I think they're so pretty, and so I'll wear them to the baby shower in September. And then I picked these up. I had not seen these. I think these are gorgeous. I have seen a lot of the fake nails, but I had not seen these ones. And I mean, they're just like brown. They remind me of a candy corn. And um, I don't know, like the sunflowers, the candy corns. I don't even know what's happening on them, but I think they're so cute. And this one kind of reminds me of like a turkey. I don't know, but they are definitely cute. And I love those colors. So I picked those up. And again, they're the 24 nails and they have the glue in them. 
Okay, so, oh, I had more cleaning stuff. I picked this up, and this, I had picked up the all-purpose peppermint sage dishwashing soap, but this one is the all-purpose peppermint sage all-purpose cleaner with plant-derived ingredients, 16 fluid ounces. So this is the actual cleaner, and I think that is super awesome. So I, it says, cuts tough grief, grease and grime with a pleasant peppermint scent. Um, I had picked up one of these, I think, from the Dollar Tree one time, and when I sprayed it, I wanted to vomit. It smelled like rotten orange juice or something. It was disgusting. It was so gross. So this smells way better. So I'll get that for cleaning. And then I think I'm just on to the crafting stuff now and fall, kind of. So a couple crafting things, then we'll move into fall. So this is just a 6.9 inch thing. Um, I'm going to make it into a Christmas tree. I want to try to, you know, make, no, not right now, but I want to try to cover this with the modeling clay for a Christmas tree and see how it goes. So that's what I'm going to do with that. And then I picked up two of the same things. So I also posted on my community tab, they had um, tacos and I think a pizza that are the patches. I'm not sure, but I, I just decided to get these and these are iron on patches and it is a gumball machine and a lollipop. That is so super cute. So I had to get two because I just think they're so cute. So yeah, and they're just from Crafter Square. I iron on patches. Yay. All right. And then I found these. So these, they are flat. So they're a rolling pin, but flat, but super cute. So it says, hello pumpkin. It's not gonna say that, I'm gonna redo it. But I mean, that is so cute. So I loved, and this one says falling leaves and they're both just rolling pins. Again, they are just flat, but I don't care. I'm not gonna leave them how they are right now. But I just, I had not seen the rolling pins there before. Maybe other people have, but I have not. So there's those. And then, I did pick this up. Oh, hold on. Sorry, my son was trying to call. You're going to have to wait. You're going to have to wait. I'm sorry. So this is the hot apple cider sign. I know they had one last year, but it, I did not think it looked like this rustic and stuff. Um, just so you know, my son needed toilet paper. But I swear to you, he always needs it. He never, ever looks. And so I'm... Mm -mm. like never looks to see if there is any and I'm just I'm done with that so hot apple cider um, has the wood on the bottom and the wood on the top looks kind of like a scroll and I just think this is so much better than last year's so I picked that one up I did pick up two of the wood books that they have and you know they're just like a block but I plan on redoing these. I saw another thing on Facebook where they redid it and then they put like, you know, the little cups with the faux toppers, everyone, it was like the big fad like two years ago, but they're putting them on top of here and it's actual like a full on decor. And so that's what I want to do with these. So I just picked up two because I'm going to do that again. I'm just going to put probably something Christmassy on here and then I'm just going to put like a faux mug on topper on here and stuff so I got that and then I didn't see this I forgot about this under there but I got this for my middle son it's a Crayola art edge includes full color poster 28 pages and one poster but how super cool is that and I didn't open it and I'm not going to but these are the coloring pages I just think that they're super neat so I picked this one up I think they're super super cute so I was very excited about the stuff I got. I really can't wait for Christmas to come out. I know people say it's too early and that's fine if that's what you think. For me, it just gives me such a feeling of that that's what I wanna see. And people are like, it's too hot. <laughs> okay, if you're saying it's too hot for Christmas and it's only 90 degrees in your town, it's 115 here yesterday, 110 today. And I still want to see Christmas. It just gives me a sense of peace. So anyways, guys, I hope that you all are having an amazing day. I hope that you enjoyed this stuff. I cannot wait to get into the holidays and haul more. And I will talk to you later. Bye, guys.